to new at six desperate to get their dog back. A Clareton family is pleading for help. Their dog was picked up running loose, taken to a kennel and then adopted four days later. Julie Grant has the story. The woman who owns the Gatos Behanna Kennel is also an animal control officer. She would not go on camera, but she did do an interview with me off camera, saying that she gave the family fair warning that she would adopt the dog out after 48 hours if they didn't pay her kennel fee. Now, the family tells me they couldn't come up with the money. So now their dog, Karma, is with a new owner. This is a family. That's not like a stray dog. It's a family dog that raised around children or anything. And it's just, you're, just, you're taken from a family. Karma is a three and a half year old German Shepherd raised by Aramis Purdue and his wife Heather Churchfield. All her life, Karma has lived with them and their children. On Sunday, they say Karma pushed open a window and got loose. He knows exactly, perfectly well whose dog it was. 100%. She knows whose dog it is. Exactly. Why? Because it's, she's, we've had run-ins you know, a time or two before. Robin Gatos Behanna says she got two calls of a dog running loose and sent one of her kennel volunteers to pick up the dog and bring it to her kennel. She says the dog is legally considered unlicensed because it wasn't wearing this blue tag around its neck. Purdue says he brought the paperwork but could not afford the $150 kennel fee. Just heartless and cruel about it, you know, so you don't understand this, this is my children's dog and our family dog, you know, it's, it's, it's not just a regular dog, just some stray dog out running around. You know? Gatos Behanna says Churchfield told her twice to just keep the dog. Churchfield admits that, but says it was because she was upset. Like I said, call me first and say, hey, look, you know, we only got too much time left. Could you, you know, if you can't come with money, I'm going to her out. There was no consent from me or nothing. She just up and up and did it. Gatos Behanna says she was upholding the laws as a humane officer and could not continue boarding Karma at her kennel. She adopted Karma out to a man on Thanksgiving. If I could speak to him and explain the situation, you know, and let my kids speak to him, he'd, understand, he'd probably understand, you know, that he would give the dog back. While the family isn't giving up hope, Robin Gatos Behanna says at some point she has to draw the line, even though she feels bad. She tells me that she has been through this same situation twice before with the family's dog karma. Reporting in Clareton, I'm Julie Grant, KDKA TV News.